Catherine. And I'm Chrissy. And we are travelling gleefully. And we are in Wales. <laughs> We are in Cardiff at the moment just for a few days, um, but we are so excited to be here. You might be confused because we've actually been to Wales. <laughs> Very briefly. <clears throat> and it was like in the midst of a longer video, so yeah. you probably missed it. It was which um, is fine. <laughs> when we went to Eurovision, we had to stay in Wales because we couldn't stay anywhere near Eurovision. <laughs> yeah. But now we're in the south of Wales. I know, and we're excited to actually like look around and explore. So far, um, we've just been like wandering through the city and there are pride flags literally everywhere there's pride everything the like, pride was like 10 days ago as well yeah and That's it's just cool. still everything is rainbow so we love to see it we really do um also as you can see we are in cardiff castle just, but just here and also here and it goes the whole way around um but there is a like concert i think on at the moment I or some kind of festival or something or... but yeah you can see all the like stuff up. yeah so we can't get very close which is a little disappointing but oh well yeah you can go oh sorry you, you can go into the castle um, and like the museum but it costs about 15 pounds each yeah um which we might do another day but we're just gonna like explore for a bit today and see what we want to spend now yeah <laughs> Alright, this is what's playing at the castle at the moment. So last night was Chicks, and then we got Sting coming up, Westlife, Hosier, Lumineers, Tom Jones. There's a lot going on. Alright, we've come to Cardiff Market. There's like so many stalls. There's like jewellery, food, like there's a book stall, yeah. everything. So it's very cool. We're going to have a look around here and get some lunch. We've just walked down to Butte Park, um, which is lovely. It's huge um, and it's just like really bushy. It's also like attached to Sophia Gardens. Yeah. Where we got off the bus yesterday. So I guess it's like maybe extra big because it's two parks. Yeah. And then this behind me, that kind of area there, we were just sitting in and it's like what remains of like an old friary from the 1200s. Um, which is pretty cool. We were sitting so there for like cool. 20 minutes, not even realizing that we were in like an archaeological site. Yeah. <laughs> um, but it's just really nice. Like it's all like, obviously you can see all the trees and grass and stuff. So it's just a nice place to walk. And squirrel watch. And squirrel watch. <laughs> like we're very close to the city. So it's very cool. is they have all of these arcades we're in one now yeah there's so, there's many. so many and they just have like shops down them they're just like tiny like I get, well, shopping arcades yeah, but like, like cafes there's so many, many and it's so fun cool. we're gonna see how many we can explore over the next few days Today we have come down to Mermaid Key, um, which is very cool. It's a very fun area. Yeah. There's obviously a Ferris wheel behind us, um, but there's like a bunch of like restaurants and bars and stuff yeah, around like here. Really cool. And then the bay is just behind us there. Yeah. So Mermaid Key is on Cardiff Bay. Yeah. And it's it took us about 40 minutes to walk here from where we're staying, but yeah. we're staying like just kind of on the other side of the city. Yeah. It'll probably so it's probably be about... 20 to 30 from yeah. the city. Um, and it's it's a pretty easy walk. Yeah. Definitely worth it to come down here, but we're going to spend the day here looking around. We've just walked like around part of the quay and we read online yesterday that there's a science museum here, um, which has cheap tickets in the afternoon because mm -hmm. um, it's like almost closing time. If so you go between 3 and 5 p.m. It's yeah. like a couple of pounds cheaper. Yeah, so we're gonna go check that out because we love a science museum. We do. Um, apparently, according to this one, they're the best one in the UK. Um, so we will see how it compares to the Glasgow one um, because that was that was pretty good. Yeah. Did we make it into the museum before we bought <laughs> food? 
this smoothie is um, pineapple, mango, and passion fruit, and mm, it is so good. really good. And these have been our recent snacks of choice, chocolate covered rice cakes. They're so good. You can't find them in Australia. And if you can, it's like health food shops or like maybe one independent health food brand in the supermarkets. But here they're freaking everywhere. done at TechniQuest. I feel like that was that went so quickly. It like did. It like two seconds ago when we went in. It did. It's two hours. What do you think? Better than Glasgow? No. No, I agree. But it was pretty good. It was just a lot smaller than the Grand yeah, Glasgow one. Yeah, it was one. really small and I feel like it was more aimed at kids. Yeah. But still a good way to like spend two hours if you're down at the harbour and I especially recommend going after I don't yeah. think we were like that rushed. No, I think we managed to see a, like a good chunk of yeah. what was there. So, if you want to spend a bit less, definitely do the three to five. Yeah, it's definitely worth it. It was yeah. really cool. Um, and now we are walking down to an area called the Wetlands Reserve um, to explore there a bit before we go to dinner. We are out again exploring more arcades of Cardiff and they are so fun. They're really cool. There's so many of them. The one we're in now, um, which I'll put the name on the screen, I can't remember which one it is, um, has this shop, you can see the sign just above Catherine's head, The Queer Emporium. And it's like a little cafe and coffee shop, but they also have like clothes, merch, merch like yeah. ba uh, badges, patches, earrings, like so many different things of like any queer related thing you want, um, which is very fun. It is really cool and there's lots of cool shops and cafes and stuff in the arcade so definitely worth like a half day of just like wandering around yeah definitely just like they're all marked on google maps just like walk through them that you'll find so many cool shops yeah. in we have come to the national museum of wales um to have a look around um it's, it's free it's free like all the time yeah um and it's got a few sections we just had a look at a little dinosaur like a tiny dinosaur exhibit and now we have come to the natural history section to look around um but there's also sections on like the history of whales and stuff yeah, i think um, there's art as well yeah there's heaps here so it's probably definitely worth having a look around yeah um but we're going to spend a couple of hours here and see how it is of Cardiff. Yeah, it's been a pretty quick three days. It has. We think you could probably do Cardiff in like two. Yeah. But if, you know, you leave time for museums like we did, 
and three is a good amount. Yeah, it was good. It's a really cool city. Like there's a lot of, it's not very big, like the city center, but with all the arcades and like shopping centers and yeah. stuff, there's a lot of really cool, like independent stores and stuff around. Yeah, so it's, it's really nice. It's definitely a cool city there. Wander around. Yeah. So we are off to Birmingham tomorrow. Yeah, we're only there for one day um, and we're hanging out with a friend. So don't know if we'll feel further. Yeah, we might, I think, we have gotten a lot of advice from people being like, you don't need to go to Birmingham. Yeah. <laughs> no offense to Birmingham people. So I'm not actually sure how much we will film, um, but anything we do film, we will put in here. Norwich in a couple of days. Yeah. So that'll be our next vlog. Norwich and Cambridge. Yeah. Uh, so thank you for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed. We do a lot of travel vlogs, so if you like any any of this kind of style of video, feel free to check out some of our others um, and like and subscribe. Follow along on Instagram. Yeah. And we hope you enjoyed the Birmingham content if there was any. <laughs> but regardless, we will see you next in Norwich and Cambridge. See you then. Bye. Bye. Thank you.